text, either a bullock or a lamb that hath anything superfluous or lacking in his parts, that mayst thou offer for a free will offering, but for a vow it shall not be accepted. Leviticus 22, 23. Commentary. Verse 23. Either a bullock, or a lamb that hath anything superfluous, or lacking in its parts, that has either more members than it should have, as a five feet, or two gristles in an ear, as Gersom says, or has fewer than it should have, or, as Jarki, that has one member longer or shorter than another, as the leg or thigh, according to the Targum of Jonathan, that is redundant in its testicles, or deficient therein, the Septuagint version is, that hath its ear or its tail cut, and so the Vulgate Latin version. That mayest thou offer, for, a free will offering, for the repair of the sanctuary or temple, as Jarki and Gersom, money, or the value of the sacrifices, might be given to the priests for that use, but according to them might not be offered upon the altar, but it rather seems to be an exception to the above law, and allows of the sacrifice of them for free will offering, though not for a vow, as it follows. But for a vow it shall not be accepted, because the other was according to a man's will and pleasure, and he might bring what he would on that account, but when he made a vow that he would offer such a sacrifice, it must be of creatures that were perfect, and without blemish.